He said, uh, uh, we're going to have, uh, first we have the boss of all bosses, which is myself. Uh, Maranzana now. Maranzana's talking. Then we have a boss, and then we have, I mean, an underboss, under the boss, and then we have an Ugabarijin. He was explaining all this. Now, uh, if, if uh, a soldier, naturally we have the soldier, if a soldier wants to talk to a boss, he shouldn't take the privilege for him to try and go direct to the boss. He must first speak to the Ugabarijin, then the Ugabarijin, and if it's required, it's important enough, the Ugabarijin will make an appointment for the soldier. And he went out to explain the rules. This is what I call the second government center. He was telling you how it is going to operate from was, now on. He was uh, describing how it's going to operate. And, and the banquet followed right after this meeting. How long, how long did the banquet meeting last? The banquet lasted. Uh, it was a five-day uh, banquet, Senator. In other words, I don't mean that it ran continuously for five days. Uh, uh, for instance, you come in early in the evening and close maybe three, four, five in the morning, and then reopen again the next day. For five nights. For five uh, nights. Five. You had, you had a banquet. Right. Right. Uh, what occurred with respect to that banquet? What was the purpose of it primarily? Well, if you well uh, uh, the purpose was he just uh, uh, the money was supposed to be meant for the original soldiers and from, for himself. The original is what I mean, which was about 15. They were about 12. Now there's three, three of us there, makes it about 15. We're supposed to be to give these boys a chance, being they were away and now they broke, and for himself. That was the purpose, and, to be, and so he'd be recognized uh, as, you know, the boss and uh, it was. And naturally, uh, they went to a lot of expense. Uh, they understand that. And that's what was the, point, the reason for the banquet. So it was a, a banquet to raise money and also to acknowledge uh, Maranzana as the boss of bosses. Right. They all were paying tribute to him and honoring him. Right. And recognizing him as the boss of bosses. Right. And this was to demonstrate it. Is that correct? What was that, Senator? This was to demonstrate it. That's right. To let everybody know that right. he was recognized as boss of bosses. Well, right. What, uh, what uh, you, you said is also to raise money. Was yes, money well, raised during that time? If so, how and from I, whom? I understood uh, it was 115,000. He, uh, he sent out, for instance, a, a thousand tickets to Al Capone, and Al Capone sent 6,000. He sent a thousand tickets to uh, Buffalo, and they also sent six thousand. And Charlie Lucky himself sent six thousand. Them are the big amounts I know. Five-day banquet to raise money is the first de first time this device has ever been described publicly. His other reflections and recollections today dealt with a man known as the Artichoke King. How a hoodlum came to be regarded as a failure in his chosen profession and died of a broken heart. Somebody described to me, I don't remember who, how Ciro was so shaky in putting the, uh, the key in the ignition that they threw him off the wheel. Uh, so I'm talking about Ciro Tavanova. And uh, they threw him off the wheel, and uh, ever since then, Ciro Tavanova was getting what we call buckwheats. Uh, getting like what? What we call buckwheats, you know, like... Uh, he was being stripped, uh, 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 you know, a little at the time. He was being taken off, uh, what, his power was being taken away from him. And uh, after a while, he took it so hard that he died from a broken heart. I'm talking about Cyril Tavanova. He kind of lost face, did he, with his... Yes. And they replaced him at that time with Mike Coppola. In other words, they felt that he didn't have enough nerve. Well, yes, he, uh, he, he uh, sort of put it this way, he disgraced himself. He disgraced himself. Uh, couldn't get the key. Uh, By showing his nervousness. Yeah, he was shaking. So uh, I got that from uh, the soldiers as we uh, go along in life. 